Hey there everyone, my name is Nathan and I'm the owner here at Minnesota Mobile Guy. If you are not already familiar with us, we're a business based here in the U.S. state of Minnesota, but we assist customers from all over the world with all sorts of different issues and services on their smartphones, tablets, and other mobile devices. One of the services that our customers most frequently ask us to perform is the removal of the Google account lock feature on an Android device. It's something that Google initiated back in Android 5 to where when you factory reset an Android device without first taking off the Google account that's on it, the device is then going to ask you to log into that account again as a security measure after the reset is completed. Now, here with us today we happen to have a Samsung Galaxy S20 that is a US model here. And this is a device that does have the Google account lock enabled. As we can see here, as we're going through the setup process, we get to the screen that says that the device was reset and to continue, we have to sign in with the previous Google account that was on it. So it's not just going to accept any Google account to be logged in. But we're making this video to let any interested customers know that we do offer a service to be able to remove the lock from this device. We've actually already done 99% of the work before we started making the video to cut down on time. And so now we'll just have to back up and start going through the setup process all over again. So we're just going to back up to the start screen here where it says let's go and tap next. And then we have to agree to the terms and conditions. And then we're going to skip our Wi-Fi because we don't need that. And then we're going to wait while it checks for updates and while it checks the info. And now we can see that the Google screen has actually changed. So instead of saying that it was reset and to use the previous account, it now asks for any Google account, just like if it was a brand new device. And you can see that you even have the option there to create a new account if you want. We're just going to go ahead and skip that for the moment because we don't actually need to sign in with one. And then we're going to go ahead and skip through the rest of the process here just to make sure that we can actually get to the home screen. I'm going to skip all the Google things. We don't need a screen lock, so we're going to skip that. We don't need any additional apps, so we're going to skip all of that. And after it checks for the finishing touches, it's going to ask us if we want to use AT&T's transfer software because this is an AT&T device. We're going to say no, and we're going to exit that. And then we don't need AT&T Cloud, so we're going to skip that too. And... We don't need a Samsung account either. Okay, there we go. Now we should be all set. Yep, and there we are. So we have now reached the home screen. We have full access to all of the apps and settings and features on the device, and it's just like a brand new phone that never had the lock on it. I'm gonna go ahead and jump into the settings here just to show you exactly what we're working with. So under About, we do indeed see that it is an S20, of course, with the 5G support, as they all do. And then that model number there, the G981U, that is the model number of all of the US versions of the Galaxy S20. I should mention that this is something that we can do for just about anyone anywhere in the world, so you don't necessarily need to be here in our local area in order for us to do this for you. You just have to have a decently powerful Windows computer along with a fast internet connection and we can connect to your computer right through the internet and perform the exact same procedure while the phone is plugged in. So if you have a Galaxy S20 and need help getting the Google account lock removed from it, we would love to help you out with that, so go ahead and get in touch with us. All of our contact information will be right down in the video description, and I'll also put a slide at the end of the video here that has all of the details there as well. While you're here, make sure to check out the other videos that we have on our channel, as we offer a lot of different services for a lot of different devices, and I'm sure you'll find something there that could come in handy someday. While you're there, if you hit that subscribe button, you'll be notified of all the new videos and services that we're constantly adding, just like this one. Y para todos los hispanohablantes, nosotros también hablamos español, así que ustedes nos pueden contactar sin duda. Thanks for watching, everyone, and have a great day.